Tonight, President Joe Biden's vaccine mandate for larger businesses is one step closer to reality. OSHA, the Occupational Safety and Health Administration, submitted its initial enforcement rule. Ten on your sides, Kayla Gaskins has more on what this means for big employers here in Hampton Roads. Kayla? Well, after President Joe Biden's vaccine mandate announcement, many large private companies took steps to implement vaccine requirements for employees, even as it was unclear how the presidential order would be enforced. Well, companies did this, and so when a standard came down, they would be ready. When the first mandate came down, there was a lot of skepticism about how it would be enforced. The president tapped OSHA for the task. Labor officials have worked since then on an emergency temporary standard to ensure workers at companies with more than 100 people are fully vaccinated. Yesterday, OSHA sent the first version of the emergency standard to the White House for review, a big step in making the mandate a reality. Local companies have prepared for this enforcement. As of today, 60% of the workforce at Newport News Shipbuilding is fully vaccinated, according to officials. As a federal contractor, all shipbuilding employees must be fully vaccinated by December 8th. Vaccination is a condition of employment. Shipbuilding workers have a few weeks to get their first doses and be fully vaccinated by the December 8th deadline. Moderna recipients need a shot by October 27th, and Pfizer need to get their first shot by November 3rd. Norfolk Naval Shipyard has ordered all civilian personnel to be fully vaccinated by November 22nd. Per the deadline, employees getting the Moderna shot needed to get their first shot this past Monday, October 11th. Pfizer recipients have to get theirs by this coming Monday, October 18th. Now, of course, the single-dose Johnson & Johnson recipients have the most time to get their shots. Newport News Shipbuilding employees who are going to get the J&J &J shot will have until November 24th. And Norfolk Naval Shipyard employees will have until November 8th. In the newsroom, I'm Kayla Gaskins, 10 on your side.